Hi guys, today is Sunday, November 26, 5.22 p.m. I have made it to Ultimate Sports Institute again. Today I will be hitting a back and by workout. And officially today has been, or today will today is um, four weeks and one day. So basically a month since I started this whole YouTube journey. And I have got to say, I have never been happier. So today, I really didn't want to come to the gym. Um, I was a little sore from having field day with my friends at Markham Park yesterday. It was so much fun, but my body is telling me you need to rest. But right now, I'm in a place where I also just love working out and bettering myself and growing. Right before my nap, one of my friends, Steven, he sent me some text messages and he said, I hope he doesn't mind that I'm sharing, but he said, hey Rich, I just saw a couple of your YouTube vids after it popped in my feed. First off, keep it up and don't get discouraged. It's a long journey if you wanna make it. Secondly, I just wanted to give a small critique if you don't mind. I think you need to focus your eyes on the camera lens more. Makes it feel like you're speaking to the viewer instead of someone off screen. Keep it up, broski. And then later on, after some back and forth, before my nap, I was really tired. He also said, always gotta stay positive. We're our biggest supporters at the end of the day. Can't expect someone else to cheer for us if we can't from within. So first off, this text, uh, was really nice for me. Um, I've found a lot of support and positive energy from lots of people in my life throughout this one month journey. Looking at the camera, speaking to the viewers, things like that are going to be something that I have to work on and I will try better. I will try better to get better at speaking directly into the camera, speaking to my viewers and being better at this whole content creation thing. Um, but to be honest, I'm so new to this even now. It's been a month. Even after I say I have to get better, I'm still looking off screen. But I will say that I'm still having a lot of fun. And I've been treating content creation, I've been creating this journey much like my passion for fitness. And I've wanted to start content creation maybe two years ago truly and even before that it's always been a dream dream of mine since college to start youtube um start some content creation and ultimately open up a gym it's always been a dream of mine um just to live life and be healthy and happy now of course it's not easy but i don't think anything in life worth having comes easy and i'm treating this content creation and this journey, much like I've treated fitness or my journey in fitness. So when I first started working out, I don't think I knew everything. I still don't know everything, but you have to start somewhere. And I could sit here and research for days on end forever, trying to find the best way to do YouTube, the best way to create content, the best way to deliver content to my non-existent or potential viewers, but you have to start somewhere. And as you start, you will grow. As you fail, you will get better from your mistakes. And right now I'm truly having fun. Um, when I really wanted to do this whole YouTube creation thing two years ago, I was still very much focused on a lot of the wrong things. So I still was obsessed with women. Um, not to say that's a bad thing, but being obsessed over something like women could distract you from a lot of the things that you truly wanna do. I also loved partying, drinking and smoking. And I won't say that anything in moderation is okay, or well, I will say anything in moderation is okay, but for me, 
I have a hard time balancing things sometimes. So I was still really looking forward to drinking and smoking and I don't think that was really conducive to me living a healthy lifestyle and for me to start a fitness channel or create fitness content. So as I'm at this point now, a month into my content creation journey, a month into YouTube, I haven't been smoking, I haven't been drinking. Um, I've been taking ice baths every other day and tomorrow will be ice bath number eight. That's some new, something new that I started, but at first I really hated it. Now I really love it. Um, I've also been cooking a lot more. That's been fun for me. I've been saving more money. Um, and I've just been trying to get better on this journey each and every day. So I've been treating life and this journey, this journey much like a game, much like the gym. And I really want to level up my IRL character. And for me, this is really fun. I'm not saying this is super easy. I'm not saying this is super difficult. But for me, this is really enjoyable. This is a journey that I have found. And when I first started this journey, uh, this is something that I decided to do because other aspects of my life were not making me happy. I felt like I didn't have control over my life. I felt like I didn't have complete freedom or freedom at all to make the decisions that I wanted to be. And in the process, I felt like I was losing my core self and losing vision and purpose in life of who I wanted to be in the future. So when I truly, truly made this decision to start this journey, it wasn't an easy one, but I will say that once I did start, I never looked back and I'm so excited to continue. So I've made a couple decisions. So I am going to record my journey on YouTube and I'll be posting content regularly. So me working out, I'll be posting that content. I've realized that a lot of people um, like short form, so fun, like short reels or short shorts. Um, so I'll be doing that as well. For me, learning all this new content creation stuff is really fun for me. Um, but again, this is for me. I don't really care what people think about me anymore. I have found something that makes me happy. I found a path for myself that makes me feel fulfilled and gives me purpose in life. So I'll continue on this journey, see where it takes me. And right now I'm not so much focused on where it will take me or the successes that it might or might not bring. But I keep coming back to the saying that Bruce Lee said, which is that the good life is not about the destination, but it's a direction. And this direction that I'm going, for me, is the one that I have found to give me purpose and give me happiness. So, again, it's been one month. For anyone who has been supporting me along the way, thank you so much. Um, for those who have liked um, my videos, subscribed to my channel, really, it does mean a lot to me. Um, again, I, I said that I don't care what people think, but that's because you can't people please everyone. You only get one life. Um, a lot of these people I don't know, some of them I do, but really this is my life. So for me to say that my whole life revolves around what people think about me will really make me unhappy. So I'm gonna continue what I'm doing. Um, I'm going to strive to be better each and every day, even looking at the camera like Steven said. Um, but yeah, thank you for everyone that's been on this journey with me so far. I'm so excited to see where it will take me. And now I'm gonna hit a really good chest and biceps workout. Thank you everyone again.
okay right now it is 6 46 p.m. so I just had maybe like an hour workout um, it was good I'm glad I came um, I always feel better after I work out for today because I had that really long intro um, I think I'm gonna go home I'm going to grab the footage that I had from today's workout maybe throw in a little bit of anime uh, non-copyright music to kind of fill in the silence sorry I'm a little out of breath and then um, just kind of upload that raw footage since I did do a lot of talking in the intro um, for this outro I guess that's what you call it I'll keep it short again uh, it's been about a month now since I started this whole YouTube journey for anyone who's been following me so far I do greatly appreciate it I've been living my life unapologetically myself uh, so I have been really happy uh, it has been uh, quite the month I feel like I've done more in this past month than I've done in the past couple years because I've just been feeling like when I was doing the whole corporate job thing that I was doing the same old same old all the time I didn't have any control over my life everyone was just telling me what to do and I was people pleasing all the time so I really didn't feel like I was able to be myself so this past month I've been able to do some things that I was more interested in um, I've been training Muay Thai, I've been cooking, I've been doing these ice baths, I've been researching health and fitness, tips and tricks and little things, I've been reading more, and I've truly been the happiest I've ever been. Uh, quitting smoking and drinking uh, and focusing more on myself and self-love has really been quite the journey, uh, has really been fulfilling and made me quite happy um, that's not to say that I don't miss drinking or I don't miss smoking of course I would love to take a tequila shot uh, but I just know that if I do that it might lead to me smoking and doing things that I really don't want to do so for now I'm really focusing on myself I'm trying to be much more disciplined and uh, in order for me to go in the direction that I want to go I understand that there are certain things that I need to cut out in my life um, and again I think balance is key um, balance is very important in life however knowing myself uh, knowing my personality at this very moment in time I know that if I don't cut out some of the vices uh, that mm, make me lose control over myself uh, it won't be good for me and the direction that I truly want to go so for now I'm living my life very disciplined I really want to better myself and in the same regard uh, with this whole content creation thing this is very very new to me so um, it's been a month I've been uploading some you like little shorts um, I've been uploading videos I've been seeing what people like what people don't like but I don't have that much data or data however however you like to say it uh, to really understand what people do and don't like so if you guys could comment down below and tell me I like this or I don't like that can I see more of this uh, maybe I don't understand some things about fitness I want to see more Muay Thai content could you show more videos of you cooking I will try my best to kind of accommodate that for my viewers because that's really fun for me too um, but what I'm doing on my day-to-day -day basis won't change but I always love feedback um, even the feedback that Steven gave me today uh, about looking more directly into the camera so it looks like I'm talking to my viewers rather than someone out there or over there um, I'm really trying to focus on doing that as well so feel free to give me critiques tips advice um, I love learning I love to grow I love to better myself so if you made it this far into the video thank you guys again for mm, supporting me on this one month journey so far it's gonna continue and I won't stop so if you could if you could give a like and subscribe down below 
and turn on the post notifications. I think that's what they call it. Um, I'll be posting regularly. And again, I hope everyone is happy, healthy, and stays blessed. Thank you guys.